Welcome back, everybody, to 60 Minutes to Lose on the Sega Genesis, the show where we play a game for an hour. It's the same thing you've always known, but what could we possibly have this time around? It's Batman, the video game, but you already knew that. This is uh, topical. I actually just watched The Batman. Great movie. Could have been longer. It's a little joke. It's an incredibly long movie. All right. This logo, it it do be spinning. I think it's slowing down, though. This is published and developed by Sunsoft, much like the NES version. But we do have to determine, will this game be significantly different from the NES version, or will it basically just be uh, like a upgraded 16-bit version? I probably won't be able to tell you one way or another because I don't remember enough about the NES version. Anyway, okay, we we can jump, we can punch, we can throw a batarang, of which we only have three more. Now, if, if there's one thing I learned from watching The Batman, it's that we should be bulletproof. This definitely feels very different from the NES version, though. I mean, again, I don't remember everything about it, but, uh, this feels slightly more beat-em-up-y. Dude, look, look at that! Look at that background! That street going down there? Fantastic effects with the rain and everything. Oh, you can block. Very nice. I've been hit. I've taken one bit of bat damage. I still have not actually gone back and watched uh, those like 80s Batman movies. Well, the ones that kind of were between the 80s and the 90s. Were they all predominantly 90s? I don't even know, man. I believe the first one, at the very least, was uh, 80s, right? I'm sure someone in the comments will know and will be able to correct me. Not like I can't just check Wikipedia once this is over. But the problem is, I'll have forgotten I even talked about it, so... Nice! More Batarangs! Well, that was a fairly simple stage, I would say. Nice. Oh, look at this guy! Okay. He's, he's a total piece of garbage, as it turns out. It's okay. I'll just regain my health like that. As I say, can I do like a jump punch or something like that? Kinda. Okay, I'm all out of Batarangs now. This isn't very good. Th that's bad. I just, I just, I just lost a life to this guy. How, how, how do I beat him? What the hell? I can pause. Oh, okay. You give me more batarangs after I died. So that's the strat. You die intentionally, and then you get more batarangs, and then you. Ah, oh, he's still not dead. Okay. Well, I lost two lives against that boss. I am not proud. <laughs> I. Don't know how you're supposed to get past him. Okay, the Axis Chemical Factory. Look at them sliding around. Of course. Great effects. You know, for the most part. Oh my god, come on. Okay, well, now I've died to them. <laughs> I don't know where I'm supposed to go! Help! I I had this exact same problem. Oh, I'm gonna game over here, aren't I? I had this exact same problem way back in the day when my uncle found a used Genesis. I was visiting. And he had, I think, like, it was either Batman Forever or Batman Returns. Hardly matters. I think they were both bad. And I could not find out how to get past, like, level one. Wait. Hold on. Nope, that's, that's not quite it. Man, if I even so much as land on them, they hurt me. <laughs> this is embarrassing, man! This is the best Batman can do? I 
I can't... I feel like I should have, like, jumped from the bridge onto these, but it's kind of too late for that. Surely the game wouldn't just soft lock you here, right? Surely there's a way to get past it. The really unhelpful part is that I'm, like, already super twitchy and anxious from a, uh, brutal day of work. <laughs> So I'm I'm uh, I'm not even mildly chill right now. I mean, you know. I assume that when we die, we'll just continue at the start of the stage and then we can try to uh jump off that pipe onto the pile of crates. For now, I'm just farming points. This is how you get the high score in Batman the video game. Whatever, just kill me. Thank you. Game over. We can continue. Great. <laughs> what is what I always wanted. Cause I... There's only so many buttons that we've got, you know? I don't know what else I could have done about that. No, you could, cause you can't make that either. Okay, so that that is not the answer. Let's use our noggin here. Let's pause the game for a second. Okay, unpause. <laughs> uh, if there were anything that I could grab onto up there, you know, that would be a very obvious answer. But there's not. This is so far, uh, not as good as the NES game. <laughs> Suffice to say. Batman, he doesn't know what he's doing, he doesn't know where to go. I mean, can I... Is there any way that I can, like, grab onto the side of it here? They don't even have, like, the wall grab mechanic that the NES version had. Meanwhile, these guys just keep showing up and killing me all over. I don't get a second to try to think of what I'm supposed to be doing from a platforming standpoint. This is a terrible, terrible start to a game. Like, if this is the first impression that you're gonna give players... Oh, man. Down and jump? No, nope, that's nothing. I'm trying like every combination of buttons that I may not have tried. That ain't it. Well, what am I missing? What am I missing? Let me check a manual. Give me a second. Let me see if someone has scanned this manual. You'd be so proud of me too, I checked my mic before I hit the record button and found that it wasn't selected and I avoided catastrophe. Batman Genesis Manual. Who's got it for me? Oh, here we go. Okay, am I missing anything in the controls here? Hmm... Press C to jump. No, I'm not really missing anything there. I don't believe. <laughs> they don't tell you much here either. Um. Wow, that was not helpful. That was not helpful at all. Like, I was so hoping I could clack onto that little nub right there, but that's... Wait! That was it! <laughs> okay! It was just very... Okay, that's how it works. Okay. I'm glad that I persisted with that concept. It has to go up and then grab, just like a grappling hook. Unfortunately, now I'm having issues, uh... Okay, I think I have to, like, immediately press jump again. This isn't like other platformers where you get the most out of your jump and then double jump. Okay, there we go. Thank God we found that out. And God willing, that'll be the only, uh... super confusing part of the game. Okay, we've died again. Whatever. You think I care? I do a little bit. I don't think they can hurt me, fortunately. At least not while I'm up here. 
Okay, and then this is where we go back up. Okay, once you know how the grappling hook works, it's pretty intuitive. Oh, I don't know how he uh, missed me there, but I accept it. That, I don't accept that. I mean, what am I going to do? Insist that it didn't happen? I guess I have to accept it. But I can at least protest it on the internet. Okay. Ah, uh, hey, now. I guess maybe they want you to use your batarangs against them. Instead, I'm just kind of hoarding them all and never using them. Because I know I'm going to need them for bosses, man. The bosses are... Garbage pay- oh, come on. <laughs> okay, okay. Wow. Yeah, this, this ain't the NES game. It's kind of not even close to being the same thing as the NES game. Which, you know, I appreciate, even if it's not as good, because at least it means I'm playing something that I haven't played before, right? Not just a not just a rehash. The slow ascent upwards. Wow. Okay. They're throwing everything and the kitchen sink at me this time around now. I was gonna say these these sliding guys are gonna just be non-stop probably. Oh god, oh god. <laughs> okay, I fell in a vat of acid and immediately died. Now we get to continue once again at the very, very beginning of the Axis Chemical Factory. Oh, good lord. Okay. Take a hit there. At least we have this part figured out. <laughs> Can't go up there. That's right. Gotta survive the sliding man's gauntlet. Should have just attacked them there, I guess. Can you avoid it just by crouching? Because he didn't hit me with it that time, but I'm not sure if that would have had a different effect if I were further away. Didn't matter with that one. <laughs> Dodged him. Didn't dodge that one. We're, we're, we're still gonna die a bunch, you know. Okay. Nice! Full health. That helps. We have not died so far. But once the uh, vats of acid show up, well... All bets are off. Nice. Dodge that again. Maybe you do literally just have to crouch. I hope so, because that makes things real simple there. Yeah, I can't touch their body this though. Yep, should have should have known. The double jump went way too far. Yeah, okay. Never mind. I, I, no, I am no longer afraid of the bazooka boyos. That sucked. I'm only afraid of falling into bottomless pits. Because they, they seem to be everywhere. Oh my. Come on now. Sunsoft, I know you know how to make an excellent Batman game. You did it once. Was it so hard the second time? Apparently, yes. <laughs> okay, so like I said, we're gonna die a bunch. We've already lost half of our lives in one go there. Okay. But this, this is... Oh, you... You absolute <laughs> jerks! Oh my god!
Okay, 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 that's something. Okay. That dude is in the vat. We're good. We're good to go. <laughs> I don't know how many continues we'll have, but this... We're probably not gonna be able to keep this up forever. Okay, now how... How bad could a mansion be? This has gotta be easier than that last place, right? Mansion level's always easier than factory levels. That's... That's the rule. Just take it slow. Take it nice and easy, except that the chandeliers are falling down. Okay, never mind. They... They have most certainly found ways to make this every bit as, uh... Agonizing as the factory. Oh my god. <laughs> okay. Oh, what the heck? He's got a big ol' axe! And he looks like Bane! Wouldn't that be funny if he was Bane and they didn't use him as a boss and just as like a one-off enemy? Never to be seen from again. Be a nice little prank. Just make every Bane fan suffer. Okay. As you say, I can handle this as long as there's no, uh... No guys shooting at me at the same time. Oh no, they're gonna be perfectly... I was gonna say, in sync and in rhythm to cover each other. Is this an extra life over here? That's an extra life. I would love it. Never mind, I died. Well, the extra life was a trap, as always. <laughs> I shouldn't have even trusted it. This is <laughs> this is the worst mansion I have ever been in. What is that jump? Maybe I'm not supposed to make a jump. Maybe maybe I'm supposed to grapple hook up there. Maybe maybe that was just me being obtuse. I'll give it the benefit of the doubt for now. But man, this is <laughs> oh, this game tests your patience. I was looking forward to something a little more, you know, good. Okay, jumping here appears to be a good strat. Yeah. Okay. If this were a Dark Souls game, you'd probably see somebody leave a uh, message there that says try jumping, or be wary of jumping, and then you'd be like, I got you, I get you. Thanks for the tip. Say, so is this gonna come crashing down, or... No, I guess that, that chandelier is a cool guy. Just jump on some heads, that's it. And now, we go up once again. Let's see if we can uh, grab on anything up there. We can! We can! Okay. You know what? Well played. It was me who was dumb. Fake Bane is not that big of a deal. Give us a bunch of... Banger, bangerangs, <laughs> batarangs. That's what they're called. They're not bangerangs. Oh my god, it's it was a one-off. Yep, there was a two-off. <laughs> As then it hit me and then still managed to kill me afterwards. Okay, well, Gee, what? <laughs> <laughs> that was that was some Castlevania levels of uh, bullshit right there. <laughs> the knockback did me in. You know what? Whatever. Fine. Fine. Play it your way, Sunsoft. You you clearly chose violence when you made this game. You know what? I'm just I'm just gonna ignore him com like completely. Nothing good can come from trying to challenge him. <laughs> okay. <laughs> you can slightly control your jumps, 
in midair, so that's that's something. You're not completely locked to your initial trajectory. <laughs> yeah, yeah, check this out. The strats! They don't teach that in Batman school. However, I, I do want those batarangs over there. Thank you. Get out of here. Get out of my face. Get out of my life. That, that sucks. Ah, oh, he crouches. That means he gets you. <laughs> I, I should have known. I should have noticed. Shouldn't have been so naive. There we go. Batarangs. Oh my god. You can even get shot in the back. <laughs> I'm not gonna say that this is my favorite game I've ever played on this channel. <laughs> Just giving me real uh, Spider Man versus the Kingpin vibes. Oh, what is this now? I'm not even gonna bother with you. <laughs> ah, shit! It's the Joker! It's okay, this guy's got a boombox. But I've got enough batarangs. <laughs> He's very, very slow. Alright, well. <laughs> as long as you have the batarangs. <laughs> The bosses are apparently very simple. Oh, look at that! Whoa! Look at that cutscene. And then he swings off into the distance. See, uh, like the presentation is good. Is, is this one of the? Uh, oh, oh! Look at this! Now it's a it's a side-scrolling shooter. All right. Well, now I'm now I'm sold. I was out, but I'm back in. What is it about Batman? Where, like, it's it's such a blatantly lame idea for a superhero. But he's always so cool. I mean, except for, like, Adam West Batman and maybe the bat nipples weren't the best idea. So I guess it's not a guarantee or anything, but, uh... When he's cool, he's cool, man. Okay, okay, just don't, don't, don't get lost here. Don't get lost in the bat sauce. Oh, here we go. Still got hit by something. Yeah, see, these stages are way cooler. This game should just be uh, these stages. But then people would have been like, oh, it's, they shouldn't have called it... Batman, they should have called it Batmobile. Except nobody would have said that because there was no discourse about video games back then. People just kind of bought the game and then talked about it. Like in the schoolyard, they'd say either, oh yeah, it was great, or oh yeah, it sucked, and then their friends would be like, okay, well, see you tomorrow. Let's go huff some paint or something. And that was just how life was back then. Was I alive to see it? Not really. Trust me. <laughs> Just trust me anyway. Okay. Wish I could hold the button down. That would make things much easier on my thumb here. But you know, we gotta... We gotta... Play just like it was back then. I've been blown up. Hopefully that doesn't set us back too far. Like to the very beginning of the level, perhaps. <laughs> Which I wouldn't even put it past it if it did it. So I'm gonna. Nope! This is definitely not the beginning of the level, which is great! The very least passable. Oh my god. Once once you start dying, you keep dying. That's the that's the shoot 'em up rules coming into effect there. 
Well, the lives start losing and they don't stop losing. You know, make up lyrics to All Star or something because it's all I can do. In peaceful protest. My god! What do you do about that spread shot thing? I guess wait for it to shoot, get a few shots in, and then drive off to the side? But that's a boring strat. Oh man, what do we got here? I, you know, didn't even see that happen. Alright, well, we continue, I guess. <laughs> I thought they pulled me right back in, and then they, and then they pulled me right back out. <laughs> This is just, this is not the game that NES Batman was. And again, I, I, I appreciate that I am trying something new here. But why couldn't it be new and also just as good? That's so much to ask. I already know the answer to that is yes, that's a huge ask. Alright. We just have to get back to where we were with minimal pain. Trying to do something like that results in maximum pain. But I'm here for it. I've eaten uh, all of the uh, spiciest hot sauces to improve my pain tolerance for Batman, even though I didn't know what was coming. I just anticipated it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You just, you, you just keep shooting. I'm not even worried about you. As long as you're not shooting directly at me, which you're all pretty bad at doing, except for the spread shot guys. Go figure. Nice. Some additional missiles. Ouch. Did that, that hurt? It's continuing to hurt. Okay, they drove off. Good, these are not my problem. Hey, give me a health pickup that I'll miss because it'll just fly right by the screen. Hey, I got the missile pickup though! Oh, come on now. Health pickup now. I'm keeping my eyes open. I'm keeping that at the absolute highest priority. Just so that it's even more embarrassing when I miss it. Okay, well. Great! I... Look, missiles are great, but I don't need more of them. I suppose I should start using them since I have such an excess of them. I did have a lot. That was more missiles that I just missed, and now I have not a lot of missiles and still not that much more health and one less life. Was it worth it? Always. <laughs> Shit. Okay, drove off. My god, it's like it, it just shot straight for me. I couldn't even do anything about it. It, it covers so much of the screen. <laughs> I'm, uh, I'm, I'm shook! Okay, we got it. But by virtue of having some lives left, certainly not through virtue of playing well. Alright, back on foot. Oh no. Now it's, now it's just a bunch of jokesters! A bunch of clowns! I wasn't expecting to f just fight clowns. <laughs> okay. Music's sweet in this stage, though. Like, do you hear this funky stuff? My god, I can't even get close to them without them. <sighs> uh. Yeah. 
I'm I'm trying to find the joy in it, but I uh, I don't know if there is any. Like, look at this. What do you suppose the game wants you to do here? Okay, that's a that's a start actually. Oh, and then we um, un unfortunately we carried too much momentum and wound up uh, touching that enemy. And then you know just continue to die. Holy moly! The continues have been very generous though. Like I don't. I don't know when we're gonna run out. I'm sure it'll happen at some point, but it hasn't happened yet. I'm full blown, just like, can I just? God, <laughs> like, what? What is going on here? Okay, you just gotta bum rush him, honestly. I still don't know about that, though. That kind of worked. That kind of worked. That didn't. I'm still dying, man. That's three lives gone. Pretty much immediately within each other. After each other, not within each other. And then, I see, he was neutral, and then as I was flying at him through midair, then he wakes up, and then he starts breathing his fire to make sure that he can get me. And, and that, yep, and then I, I, if I simply drop down, I touch him, and then he does damage. This is, ooh. This game is disastrous right now. I like the... I like the fun games. And the o the offices of Sunsoft, they were like, what do you think, should we make this game a fun game? And one man wearing an, a monocle and an eye patch said no. Make it one of the unfun ones. Okay, anyway. Enough of that. Time to fight the guy with the swords. Who apparently cannot be hurt. Apparently he can, just it's 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 not gonna be easy on me. Wait, have I found it out? Kind of. Still struggling a little a little bit here, but uh There we go. The, the least that I could do for myself was not start flailing. I had to look for those patterns immediately, and boy howdy, I think we found one. Oh yeah, jump like that so then you can face him and get a punch in. Okay, he wasn't that bad. He wasn't that bad. Got him with no problem. In the sky over Gotham City. Whoa! Look at this now. We're in the Batwing. Which has slightly questionable uh, animations, but it's fine, I guess. It's just like the Batmobile, but it, it's a little more awkward. <laughs> Like, I, I don't know where my hitbox is. <laughs> you need to know where your hitbox is if you're in a shooter. Or at least a shooter stage. Okay, okay. Avoided those. That's good. Oh, I did not avoid that one. This looks very arcadey. Like, those... Those giant clown sprites. Oh no, that's the end of the continues! I knew we'd run out eventually. Oh. Tragedy. This is on normal too. Alright, well, let's try this, let's try this again, I guess. You know. 
The game lulls you into a false sense of security with the with the first level. It makes it seem somewhat easy after I, you know, take multiple pieces of damage. If I die, I'm resetting. Straight up. I will not die on level one. <laughs> I guess I will die on level one, you know. I was not given a choice in the matter. But I have to preserve all of my batarangs. The guys with the guns take multiple hits, just to be really annoying. But not only will I shoot you, but I will withstand you as well. Batman doesn't look that. I have to wait for the traffic light to say walk. Wouldn't it be great if it did? Just be even better attention to detail. Again, I wish I wish I found the game more fun because I do find it very appealing to look at and listen to and all that. Just, uh, the actual process of playing it is uh, <laughs> it's it's difficult. <laughs> you can't kick the trash can and make it roll across the screen. One out of ten game. Alright, well, that gives us ten whole batarangs to deal with, uh... Big asshole here. Which I seem to have immediately forgotten that I have to crouch to hit him with one. We'll have to land a couple hits off on him here. Um, like, can I jump behind him like that? Not really. Kind of. Okay, we got him. We got him without a death. And managed to pick up that extra health as well. And now it's the chemical factory. Okay, well, at least we made it through level one with no deaths and no continues used. It's a small consolation, but it is a consolation. Can't believe how long I was stuck right there. I'm not, I'm not saying that in a, oh wow, I was dumb to not figure it out kind of way. I'm saying that more like a, I can't believe that it was that stupid to have to figure out. Okay, at least now I know. I can avoid damage. By ducking. Yeah, yeah. Don't even risk it, man. Just. There are no biscuits, so there's no need to risk it. Has, has, has anybody said risk it for the biscuit once in the past, like, 12 years. Okay, well, that's fine. We didn't we didn't get that, but we uh we did get down here. Now. Be careful around here. Be careful. Good. Just slow your pace. We didn't die that time. <sighs> Amazing. Amazing. I am astonished at how much better I'm handling this stage. I still have not been hit somehow. I feel like I probably should have been hit by that uh, bazooka guy, but uh, the game had mercy on my soul. Okay. Whew. This is where things uh, get a little bit hairier, but honestly not even that bad. Okay. 
yeah, this this is the whole problem section right here. Okay, well, look at that. Not even bad. Not even hard. <laughs> I'm fine. <laughs> you figure the level out, and then the subsequent playthroughs are not that bad. Okay, okay, okay. It's you know, some games are easier to figure out than this. One. I shouldn't say easier, I should say more fun to figure out. It's okay, check out my Mario strats. You just, you just have to jump on the enemies. Bop. <laughs> Got him. That's still a spooky jump, but we made it. Oh, I'm so proud of myself right now. <laughs> Remember, there's there's an extra life over there, and it's not. It might now be worth it. No, I don't know. I don't even know how I how I begin to get it. I'm really upset that I died right there, but it's fine. It's one death in three stages. How bad could it possibly spiral? <laughs> It's okay, it's okay, it's okay. Getting hit once is worth it to get the full life refill there. That's just basic math. We didn't get hit by him. That's great. That's less great, but that's eh, good. Top off your health right there. Came around to basically not matter at all. Stop it! Let me let me just get you out of here without me dying. How about yo? And that that's exactly what happened. Okay, I'm getting better. I don't think the game is, but I am. <laughs> okay, this section. Don't forget about this section. I really would rather not. My god, okay, fine, fine, I'll use the damn batarangs! Oh my god, I can't believe I died there. Okay, well... I almost made it over there! Okay, losing multiple lives there sucked. Big time. Especially since I got very, very little out of it. That was... Nasty. I, how'd I get that? How'd I get past that part the last time? Was it just as sloppy? Because that would make sense. Okay, once it comes down, yeah, yeah, yeah. Basic physics. This dude, you just... You use the coward strats on. It's the only way you'll beat the game. Get the batarangs over here. We're gonna need every... Every batarang we can get. If we hope to... Beat the green goblin. Don't, don't, don't go too crazy here. Yo. Amazing. Amazing. Okay, less amazing. Now we just spend some time up here. And then go back down here, I guess. I can't go back for the for the batarangs. Okay, going uh, go, going up top was a major trap as it turns out. <laughs> Get out of here. Get out of here. That's right. Don't 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 even fight him fair. Just do it the dumb way. Just like that. And then this guy. As long as I kept enough batarangs, which I believe I did, this guy should not be even the slightest problem. He's just very slow, you know? And I'm pretty sure that if I try to throw a batarang off screen, it won't hit him. Yeah, correct. It didn't hit him. Okay. 
Come to me, Joker. See, I could have snatched him right there. Game over. Easy. Credits roll. We did it successfully. Whoosh. Gotham City Street. Great. Back, back to this. <laughs> back to this absolute clown fiesta. Hey, I got, I got one of the two. I was almost at full health to begin with, but. I think the secret to the boss in this stage is also just to stay low, because his dang it, his shots seem to skew up, if you know what I'm saying. I don't know what I'm saying, so I wouldn't blame you if you didn't. Okay. But look at how quickly we've made progress on this, man. Like, It, it took us no time at all to get back to the Gotham Street stage. Okay, well, we did we did get hit by that. That's true. Which I wouldn't grade as a great thing. It's just so satisfying to actually get them, right? I mean, you can avoid them easily enough and not get shot, but it's a whole other thing to watch them go boom. Very good. I'm holding my breath. I'm holding my breath. I'm trying to make it through all this in one piece. Enjoy the wonderful music. It's the one thing that I cannot fault the game for is I think the music is pretty dang good. Yeah, say what you want about modern gaming. Those Arkham games best Batman has ever been in video game form. Whoo-hoo! Okay, missiles. So let's use them. Don't need to use them for this one enemy, because it's, it's not hard. This dude absolutely... Ah! Lose a life anyway. I just want to not lose all of my lives by the time I get to the uh, boss, you know? Which is probably gonna happen, because I don't know how to avoid those spread shot buffoons. Okay, is this so far? That was a great strat! Stay low to the screen! I observed that from my last toils. We still haven't even used a continue. Okay! Everything is coming up Batman, I'm, but now we're on this stage and we're screwed. Come on now. Okay, someone managed to take him out while he was kicking towards us. That seemed to have been luck. Holy cow, hold on, hold on, hold on, watch this. Watch this, boy. I got one. If I can get those last two, it'll be worth dying even once more. Okay, okay. That's totally worth it. That stocked me up on a little bit more lifeage. That is not so worth it. Do they keep respawning? Can you just, like, get infinite lives here? Oh my god, how many times can you do this? 
<laughs> Can you actually just do this ad nauseum? Have I found the... The secret to beating Batman? Can you even go above nine lives? No, I don't think so. So, yeah, I don't think you can go above nine, but that, that is helpful. <laughs> Found that all by myself. I'm so proud. Oh my god. <laughs> that doesn't mean I know how to handle any of this here, but, uh... Nice, got him, got him. Now he's out of here. Alright. Oh, alright. Our favorite friend. The this guy. Just remember, the strats. It's slow, but it's it's effective. Don't, don't, don't choke, that's all. Very easy to choke. This isn't supposed to be like Raj al Ghul, is it? <laughs> I doubt it. This is probably just some whatever guy. Raj al Ghul, Raj al Ghul, I don't remember how they pronounce it. Oh my god, I'm choking! I told myself don't choke. My brain said don't choke, my fingers said yes, choke. Okay, it doesn't count as a choke until we're dead. <laughs> Come on now. One more hit. One more hit, there we go. Got him! Seven and a half more minutes of this game. It is more enjoyable when you know what you're doing. I'll, I'll tell you that much. Just thinking that that first run through is harsh. Your first time trying to understand what you're doing in the game. It's very unforgiving. All right. Now we just we shoot, we shoot. Ah, we still we still get shot, unfortunately. This is what I'm really trying to avoid. But we have we have lives. We have more lives than we started the game with, which is going to help us out a lot, obviously. Oh, there we go. We finally got shot down. But we'll come right back. See, look at that. Wasn't even worried. Oh, what do we got here? The big copter? I I I I I don't like it. Get the big copter out of my face. Of course, I should have known it's as easy as just firing all missiles. Okay, we got it. We got it! <laughs> we, made, we made it past. I am super impressed with myself. Not only did I recover and get back to that point, but I progressed past that point. Nobody can take that away from me. Oh. It wasn't as bad as it looked. What, I can't just jump on you? I think I can, I just slightly missed him. Well, I found the easy passage here. <laughs> and now this level feels like, you know, a, a nice little uh, break, pretty much. Give me the batarangs. Oh, look at, look at how I timed all that. 
handled like a true Batman pro. The uh, Genesis Batman uh, competitive scene is looking real weak lately here. Tell all, your, tell all your friends, you need to crown a new Genesis Batman world champion. Okay, going down here was a big mistake. turned out worse though actually punch punch <sighs> game's taking up a lot of my energy here I haven't had time to babble about completely irrelevant topics it happens every now and then you know That's an extra life, one that I didn't even have to work intensely for. And look at all the batterings I have. Enough to make this dude humble pie. What do you got now? Oh, okay. That wasn't the end of the level. <laughs> if anything, now, now the level got nasty. This feels like a close to the end of the game kind of level, honestly. Unfortunately, I'll have to actually fight this guy fair and square. Oh, dude! What is this literally just like a jump on him, boss? Could I have done that since stage one? <laughs> Oh, that's a great strat. That's funny. I didn't even think about that in the first stage. So I just I guess I hadn't quite yet realized that uh, you could just Mario enemies in this one. Ouch. That hurts. He's still beating me. But I still have hella lives, so who cares? Get him without dying. You'll feel great. Yeah! <laughs> Look at that. It's stupid. <laughs> okay, just patience. Yeah. This reminds me actually a lot of that final level in Shadow Dancer, where it's just like a barrage of all the enemy types. It's a straight up boss rush. Okay, I'm probably gonna die here, because I, I I have to beat him flawlessly. This is absolutely the last level, isn't it? Oh man, I'm gonna just run out of time to actually beat this whole game on camera. Provided I'm correct, but like, come on. When else do you get hit but when else do you get hit with a boss rush? That is not a middle of the game kind of trick. Unless they're feeling exceptionally crazy. I haven't died yet. There's still time for that. <laughs> Smack. It does take a while to finish off. Come on now. One more hit, one more hit. Since I whiffed him a couple times there. There we go. Two. <laughs> What else we can accomplish in about 40 seconds? No, oh, the guys with the guns from like stage one. Been a while, friends. Now what do we got? What do we got? Bring them on. Let me see them. Oh, crap. I never had to actually fight this guy for real, so I don't have any strats. <laughs> I always just use batarangs! Aw, oh, shit. This is gonna hurt. Correction, it already hurts. That seems like a strat, though. Aw, oh, until he charges you. 
Oh, yeah, I got him. That's time, though, unfortunately. That's all we can do. You didn't get to see uh, the final boss fight, which I'm very sure we were uh, right up on, because, again, boss rush. Come on. Unless I'm wrong, and there was way more level to go. <laughs> hold on, hold on. Let me let me just look it up here. Let me look it up here. Sure, sure, surely there is a walkthrough somewhere that tells me exactly how much there was to do in this game here. Let's see. Batman. Now we gotta find the correct Batman. Hold on, hold on. Batman, the video game. That's what it's called. There we go. Genesis version. Yeah, Gotham Cathedral is the final level. I, dude, okay. I could easily beat this game with the Infinite Lives uh, mini hack in that one level. And then when you figure everything out, you get you get everyone's patterns right. That's beatable. I th that first run through felt like hell, but the the more you get used to it, the more okay it is. And it's presented very well as well. Okay, you know, that's why That's why we do it. That's why we do 60 minutes to lose. That's why we play them for an hour. Because you get such a different perspective when you play it for that long. Okay. Well, that helped the game a lot. It's still not amazing. But it's better than I thought it was. So that's... That'll get it some bonus places here. And with that, we have finished off every game that came out on the Genesis in June 1991. And you know what that means. I'm going to rank them off for you here. In order from worst to best. Worst, bottom of the barrel, was hardball. I mean, it was a baseball game. It wasn't much else beyond a baseball game. Uh, above that was Midnight Resistance, which... Is so forgettable that I can just barely even remember what it was like. Above that was Star Control, which um, was basically just a tech demo for Star Control 2, which was a real game. Above that is Stormlord, an absolute troll game, but a well-presented one that I had a lot of fun with. Above that, I put Batman, the video game. It, it would have been way lower had I not figured the game out and uh, been more fair to it. Above that is Twin Cobra, great version of Twin Cobra. Above that is Wings of War. You you know, good old Wings of War. <laughs> Above that, I put Fantasy Star 3, which, you know, we didn't get to put nearly enough time into. Above that, Valus 3, the most cinematic platformer of this era so far until a better one comes along. Above that is Shadow Dancer, taking on a beautiful second place because it was a great game. And, of course, number one had to be Sonic the Hedgehog. Call it bias. Call uh, No, don't call it bias. It's not like I made the game or anything like that. I don't, know, I don't know anyone who made it. It's just a great game. And, yes, it's the one that I'm, that I'm the most familiar with. That is true, but come on. It's a gorgeous game. It's a fun experience. Everyone loves some good old classic Sonic. Well, with that, we're going to go right into the next month we're gonna go into july 1991 and we're gonna start off with something that i really don't want to play but i'm gonna have to a 688 attack sub yeah i don't think it's gonna be a schoon i think it's gonna be more of a silent service kind of game which you know we do what we must as always though thank you so much for watching i'll catch you next time